Hello everybody, my name is Benjamin Tuttle, and I'm going to show you how to make vampire teeth using the Morph Animation tool in iClone. When it comes to Morph Animation, we need to make two versions of the character. One without the Morph, and one with the Morph. So I created a character here and brought him to iClone without the Morph Animation, and now I need to make the vampire fangs. It's pretty simple to do. Uh, the first thing I need to do is go to scene and then I'm going to select my character here and then I'm going to select on vampire based teeth. There we go. And next I need to just open the mouth so just go to display and then the mouth icon and just open that. There we go. And then you need to go to uh, morph and then make sure you select CC based teeth for this otherwise you're not going to find it. Uh, pretty much it gives you a whole bunch of sliders to work with. Uh, the first thing I need to work with is called Top K9 Teeth. I'm going to turn that up all the way. And then for the bottom one here, the bottom K9 Teeth, I'm just going to do halfway. You don't want to do too much. It kind of looks a little... If you uh, turn it to 100, it kind of looks a little ridiculous. So I like to do half uh, to 50. So 100 for top and 50 for bottom. You can also do crooked and do a whole bunch of features, but in this case, I think it's just, uh, it just looks a little bit better with these two. So I'm going to export the character and bring it into iClone. Okay, so I'm back in iClone. I kind of created a brief little motion here. It kind of looks a little creepy, but with the vampire teeth, he's gonna look even creepier. So I need to go to my motion and then go to Morph Creator. This is why you need to create two different versions. So it's going to load up the Morph Creator. Okay. So the first thing I need to do is I need to edit the morph, but only for the teeth here. So let's just find the teeth. There we go. And then click on that and then click on this plus here. And then you're going to load up the character Chester with teeth or whatever your morph was. And that's really all you gotta do. Yes, so it's gonna show the vampire teeth. So update morph to iClone and let's go and see if this works. Just want to keep it in just in case. Okay, there we go, there we go. So let's go with teeth, and then you want to go to Morph Animator. And when he moves his mouth, there we go. So yeah, you just want to slightly, uh, you just want to animate the morph just a little bit, so. There we go. See? <laughs> uh, so that's really all you got to do for the morph animations. Very simple. I had a question earlier and from somebody saying, how do you export this to Unreal or Blender? Well, it's actually fairly simple to do. So once we're done with this motion, the first thing I need to do is we're going to go to the timeline and go to Collect Clip. And then you're going to right click and then go to add motion plus to library and then uh, go to your character and this is also the reason why you want to do motion plus is it's going to save the morph with it so the vampire teeth is going to grow when you bring a character into unreal or blender so just save it as a motion plus okay so i'm going to go with uh vampire chester there we go all right, and I'm going to completely just remove object animation. And then just got a date modify there. And then here's the motion plus file. And let's just play the motion plus file there. There we go. And then you want to go to your flags. So flag that and flag that or whatever you want to bring your motion into the markers. And then just export it as an FBX to whatever you want, uh, Maya, 3ds Max, Unity, Unreal, Blender. 
So uh, it, it's going to work in this range. And this is really how to export FBX characters, like if they're talking or if there's eye movement or facial expressions into any of these programs, you need to save it as a Motion Plus file. And this also includes morph animation. So hopefully this will help you. Um, my name is Benjamin Tuttle. If you like this video, feel free to like it. And also it will help me